know they say home is where the heart is, but home is also the trash can. Mm -hmm. where you make it, I guess. Did he bail off? I can hear the demons call when they do what they do And now I feel like taking off, find a place with a view The pain is never gonna Yeah, unfortunately I don't have keys, so hopefully it's unlocked, otherwise I gotta drill them. Yeah. But... Oh, yeah, a bunch of screws and stuff. No, take measure and use it. Oh. Did he bail off? You think so? All right. She said they've been gone. She hadn't seen them in a while. A neighbor from across the street.
broken glass. Oh, Gotta check that garage too. Okay. Have you gone out in the basement? Yeah. Okay. Okay. It was a cat that he took off. Probably a stray then. Yeah. And uh, looks like the the door handle got uh, broken or they smacked it or something like that. Okay. You want me to hang around a little bit for change the locks? I'll hang around a little bit. No, I feel like these people are probably gone. Okay. I feel I feel pretty good about it. I'll, I'll stay for like ten minutes or so. Okay. My next one's not. Hopefully. Somebody screaming at us. No, I think it's. You the people across the street saying bye. Hopefully the wood out here is uh, good for boarding up that window. Okay. Probably something I can use. I saw a, uh, there's a piece of plywood in there, okay. and then there's a bunch of planks everywhere. There's even planks on the side of the porch, so I don't think we'll have any trouble covering that. Okay. Okay. Yeah, three and three, I suppose. There's no, no locks upstairs. Three and three. Which 25th? On the corner here, the one The blue one? Under eviction? No, the screen one, the corner. Oh. They, they were doing like all kinds of stuff out there. I wonder if that's us or the tenants building that like enclosure. real bad. Three and three. Yep, and handles. 
Hả? Dốp Yeah, we're good. Thank you, sir. No problem. Let me give you my card. Okay. If anybody shows up or anything like that, give me a call. We'll back. do. I'm oh. not called 204-2100. That's the police. If they come back to you, have a trespass. Tell them I was here. Okay. You can call me. 204-2100. Yep, that's the police. So 911, of course, is in an emergency. But yes. Yeah. Just let them know I was here. They look outside. They look in. They know who I am. All right. Just in case somebody pops in and starts giving you a hard time. Okay. Thank you, sir. Same time, like for winter, you got the house all closed up and heat cranked. Yeah. And it also smell very doggish. Yeah. Luckily, luckily, we didn't have any of those. Everything we did over the winter was duplexes. Oh, that's a creepy little area in the west basement. I was seeing one. Holy shit. Yep, that checks out. That checks out. We'll go down <laughs> I gotta bring in some tools still. Take your time. story. If I tell your story and don't attribute it to you, like that's your story and I can absolutely
Yeah, that won't go a long way if uh, if your new house doesn't have that same. Yeah, right. Well, they left one, thankfully. And said, "All right, living room's pretty important." They die in the other room, but the living room. I mean, it's in the name. You have to be living in the living room. Do you? Absolutely, man. If you die in the living room, does it change the? It's the dying room. I heard that early settlers, the ones that like built up houses and shit, mm -hmm. when people died, they just left them in their living room for a few days. Like the viewing room? But I think that's where it got its name because you would come view these dead people. I don't know. In the unalive room? The unalive room. <laughs> Damn, Father's Day 2020 was special, dude. He loved it so much, never took it down. He loved it so much. Never it down <laughs> Did we clean it up? Hell yeah. You know they say home is where the heart is, but home is also the trash can. Mm -hmm. Home is where you make it, I guess. I always feel more homey when I throw trash all over my own house. I do too. You know, anytime I'm sitting there and I see in my house, and the floor is being slapped and stuff like that. This ain't it. This ain't it. Here's and I just go in the kitchen and I dump a gallon of Hawaiian punch on the floor and I'm like, perfect. And you're like, all right, daughter, stepping in. <laughs> go all yeah, over the house. Run around, around the house, touch everything. This, this place needs to be sticky as all get out. The stickier, the better. I totally expect these people to be here today. Yeah? Yeah, only because they didn't show up to court. I was imagining So you just thought maybe they didn't know? Yep. I thought we would get one of those ones like uh, I did in North Homestead where the guy was like, Oh man, I didn't even know. You mean that's today? That's today? Yeah, man. Unfortunately, we're kicking you out right now. You're going to have to go. No, bailiff uh, put papers on your door. You didn't read them? Nah, dude, I don't, go, I don't go outside. Are you kidding me? I don't got time for that. What do you want me to do? Go out there and touch grass? Make me itchy. I was outside when I heard uh, the bailiff like, Who's in here? You spook him? Yeah, I did. <laughs> I knocked on the door and said, Hey, Vince, Vince. He must have been standing. He was at the like, kitchen door. Because yeah. uh, he said, uh, Yeah, there's some wood in the garage. He was like, Oh, cool. I'm going to go check out and see if there's anything I can use for the kitchen window. Yeah. When I, I saw made it like two steps and then I heard him like, Who's there? <laughs> when I saw the door open, I was like, oh, okay, I'm not Nah. Just the plain Jane addiction. Extra plain. The, no one's here and there's no need to move things outside. I know, right? There's literally, they just literally left our kind of like, it looks like they even might have left us a set of keys. No, it's just a key for some reason. A key. A key. Yeah. All right, this one's easy. Bless you. Thanks, man. Bless you. So not to get off track, but I was telling my wife about Secret, Secret Hitler. Yeah. Very excited about this game. Did. We can play again. Okay. Well, now that we all know the rules. Yeah. No cheating next time. Hey, no cheating next time.
You can also uh, play more werewolf and such. Yeah, werewolf. I think with that people, that game would be awesome. The werewolf game. Yeah, when you have uh, like max amount of people and everyone's played enough to where you can utilize those useless cards and those like really complicated cards. Mm -hmm. I mean, one of my friends introdu introduced me to that game, so it was uh, playing with him was always a lot of fun. Try to get him involved for one of them in the future. I think I like half spray paint. I, uh, and then I, yesterday I was trying to find kaiju to watch. Is that a movie or a show? I thought a kaiju was like a monster. Like a Japanese word for monster. Other friends were saying you've got to watch kaiju, so I went home and looked for it, and all I found was this, uh, animated thing. And then I started reading them, and I was like, oh, this is actually pretty good, dude. Hmm. I don't know if it's the same or not. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I know he started a fantasy series. That's gotta be that's it. Because yeah. I found that there was like two episodes released of it. I'm leaving this up here, so hopefully there's no bugs. Yeah, you know, I think I did too. Kobe. Oh, Kobe. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking missing. <laughs> Mr. Mizo, I try to remain prepared. You know, a couple of fentanyl overdoses will change my mind. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta touch some of that special sweet stuff. Yeah. Any white powder you see, touch it and then touch your face. Well, yeah. Like, right, mmm, this one's trigger. Mmm, I think this one's fentanyl. Hurry, go to the car. Get the Narcan. We don't have Narcan. Oh man. That's it. I'm you can buy it off the shelf in California. You can do it. I'm pretty sure it was the state that they said. Yeah, they have like over the counter uh, OD stuff. If you. Yeah. Well, that only works if you're doing drugs with somebody. Right? If you're doing drugs by yourself, I guess you just die then? I guess so. Hmm. So is that what the new message is? Don't do drugs alone? Instead of don't do drugs, it's do <laughs> drugs with a friend? Yeah. <laughs> if you're going to do, if you absolutely have to do drugs, this is not advice. Legally, I think I have to tell you guys that. Do yeah. it with a friend. And don't do it at the same time with your friend, because if you're both overdosing... Like, oh man, my friend's dying, but I can't feel my arm, but I can't move. I'm, I, <laughs> I think I'm, I'm dying. How bad, too? I'll see 
leave him on the other side, I guess. There must be a hospital nearby. There's a lot of... Ambulances. Yeah, they are in Lorraine, so they could just be heating the ice. What is going on? At 10.30 in the morning, probably a leave. It's the perfect time to do it. Yeah? Yeah, because no, the, they won't be as busy. Before noon, but after the late night rush. Yeah, after the late night rush, before the you know, morning car accidents and stuff. No, that's the perfect time to leave. Okay, okay, okay. How long do you think this place was empty with this window just broke out like that? <laughs> I don't know. The bailiff went in the garage. He's like, yeah, I gotta make sure they don't like lock up any pets or anything. He's like, yeah, just saw a cat. Probably a stray. But I wonder if the kitties are coming in and out. Probably. There's enough little stuff on in here to nibble on. I guarantee there's mice. It may be a little bit of warm. Yeah. here anymore so maybe they had it for a little while That's probably it. That's probably it. so you said 25th is in court for eviction, for eviction yeah. I can't believe it matter of fact There was a, they were living in a trailer, like there were so many people in that house. They used to have a trailer beside the house. I remember. I thought maybe it was all that, uh, all that roof leak. <laughs> maybe that's why they weren't in there. I was going to say, it'd be pretty, uh, pretty wild to evict those people about how horrible that house is. Yeah, all the dogs and Yeah? Yeah. What'd they say? Nothing. They're like, nah, man. You ain't the government, we ain't listening. I even tried to email them from my burner account, Greta Thunberg42069, and they, they just ignored <laughs> it. <dude. laughs> Apparently, they just don't care about global warming. They don't care until they get their tax breaks for being so green. Do you get tax breaks for being green? You get tax breaks if you get like the windmills and solar panels and other green energy. But at the same rate, the people that are like putting uh, wind farms in the ocean are also putting them in like Places where there's endangered whales, so they can't get in trouble because it's green, but they shouldn't be able to work there at all because it's a protected area for whales. Doesn't make any sense. It's all a sham. Sounds like the Japanese government. It's all a sham. What about the whales? I care about the whales. Why? Ever since I saw Finding Nemo. Were there whales in Finding Nemo? Yeah, man. Dory was talking to them, remember? She's like, Oh, yeah. Hello, where is the Nemo? That kind of stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, dude. I forgot about that. Yeah, she does. She speaks fluent whale, dude. Who knew Ellen DeGeneres knew so many languages? 
and beats her employees. <laughs> Or whatever she got in trouble for. What? She was abusing people, right? Maybe not beating them, but like verbally. Yeah. I'm not surprised. I'm sure everyone's a piece of shit. It's Hollywood, dude. You gotta be. They're probably wondering, like, wait, you're not a piece of shit? You can't come here. You better get out of here, dude. That's yeah. fucked up. It's lined up. I'm assuming these are probably pretty long. Yep. Uh, I like how they added a steel plate right here. Smart. From here to here. Yeah. Good luck. I hope it doesn't get kicked in. Probably from the kids in the room running through the house, slamming into doors and shit. Full sprint. Full sprint, head down, arms back. 100% CTE rate. 100% CTE rate. Alright, well. Do you ready to go to the garage? Me. Look at this, dude. Is that a... Is that a Mr. Bean right there? Oyo! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the jungle. Dude, this is like cast iron. This thing's amazing. Huh? It looks like an old tin ladle. Look. Mm -hmm. I think it's extra good with all that hair on it. Oh my god, you can't see it. Hold on, let me turn around. Yeah. I wish I knew what kind of one it was. It does look like one. You know where you melt down a little tiny bit of tin to make like... An old revolutionary bullet? <laughs> yeah, old... <laughs> like Mel Gibson and the Patriot? A single... Don't do this to me, Gimbal. Don't you dare shit on me now. No, this is, this is the shit I was talking about. I charged, you charged those batteries, they were blue. Yeah. And then I took the charger and charged them the entire way here. And they're still all wonky and caddy wampus. 30 minutes is like the max run time on this Gimbal. Oh! Garage we go. I hope you guys like Minimal movement. Minimal. I can't wait to dig out wood. Spider in it. Wow. I'm sorry if you're in there. No! Uh, There's a, a giant tub of enchilada sauce in here. Yeah? You want to go pop in there, use that ladle, and 
Warm it up on the cooktop. Make a couple of enchilada sandwiches. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> enchilada sauce and nothing else. <laughs> Bread. It's an old school favorite of mine, dude. I like enchiladas. Yeah, they're not bad. I really like Mexican food. The Mexican people really knew what they were doing when they invented Mexican food. They're like, dude, this is going to take the world by storm. When they said world, they meant like the USA. I wonder if they knew the cultural significance of it, much like, you know, Chinese food. Like any kind of food? Yeah. Is that when everyone realized, like, Americans just love to eat. Let's just put everything there. Yeah, I mean, back when we were just coming over here, dude, we were just eating charred buffalo meat that was... Fucking tree bark. Yeah, tree bark. Learn how to plant from the natives. Eating pemmican, which is literally just buffalo fat and meat that's been, like, smoked and then left to harden. Jerky. Mm-hmm. Without those roots, though, man, we might not even have jerky right now. Tragic. You know, I've, I've done this enough times where I think I've got a system going. Yeah. And sometimes, sometimes it's nice to hear that. Yeah, every time I come out here, I'm just in awe. You're like, wow. It's like he's done this two, three hundred times. Yeah, right. A couple, two, three hundred times. We should uh, oh, wait, play more Secret Hitler. We should. It's such a fun game. I like blasting music when there's a winner. <laughs> yeah. They should make like a Civil War version of that game. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, I mean, they can do a couple of different ways. They can add a... They can do a Communist Revolution one. Or not, well, a Russian Revolution one. Mm-hmm. Be like the Bolsheviks and all those nerds. That's what I'm talking about. Big fan of nerd stuff. Especially if it has to do with history. What's happening? It's going over the... Sometimes these bad boys just need a good screw in to get started. I like to spin in them sometimes. Just in case they're too hard. Too. They're too. They're not lubricated enough. Alright, come on. Get out, get out, get out. She's tight, She's tight now. Please fit. Kind of dark in here. I'm trying to help. Look, this I'm camera. trying to open that door, but that wasn't going so well. This fucking camera light is maxed out, and this is the brightness we get a tiny bit. Like barely see in front of you. Mm -hmm. Peter's a good fiddling. A super fiddling, if you will. This is a, uh. Gonna be a big nothing sandwich on the body cam. Lots of drill footage. Lots of introducing yourself to fucking the, the bailiff, the one bailiff. Put a lot of faith in that guy. He was pretty nice. First time uh, dealing with him. Mm -hmm. Or just Lorraine in general. He's like, yeah, need anybody, call the police and tell him I was here. 
like, okay, he's like, obviously it's an emergency. Oh, I don't know. I'm like, yeah, basic, he, I got you. When he came in on me, he was like, oh, thank God. You're a big guy, I don't want to tussle with you. Like, I don't want to tussle with you either. Not mm. unless you make me. <laughs> I, I was like, you have a gun. You have a gun. It's a lose-lose tussle situation. Yeah. The best thing I can get out of that is to get shot and die. That doesn't seem good. You might be able to, uh... No, probably not. I couldn't sue. I walked into an active fucking crime scene. True. <laughs> Almost announced. Yeah. You attempted, but I just don't think anyone heard you. Yeah, I think he just heard me saying Vince. And he was like, who, who the fuck is there? Who the fuck is Vince? I bet I wasn't there. I'd be like, oh, yeah. it's me. It's just Matt. Don't worry. Don't shoot him. Actually, I don't know that guy. <laughs> shoot him. Multiple times in the chest if you can. He was a fucking werewolf and a fascist at my house. I was a werewolf one time, and I was murdered. Not as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> you were a werewolf damn near every time. It's, it's insane. I like the last game where I was like, you guys are definitely not going to believe this. But I swear to God. <laughs> God can't save you from this hunter here. <laughs> right? <laughs> you got an itchy trigger finger. They added a little metal plate on this one, too. But I don't think it's going to work much. I got hope that they break in here and steal some shit. They're not good in here at all. Well, they can steal stuff after I use that plywood. Yeah, take everything but the plywood. Especially because that's going to be on the kitchen window, so like... Oh, so we need Yeah. Oh, those are nice big sheets of plywood, too. Those would be perfect. Yeah, the two in the back? Yeah. Should be good to go, and those are the, uh, as far as I was able to tell, that's the only window I saw that was broken. Well, what the hell is going on here? I've seen a lot of metal in here. You think these people are scrappers? Rappers, heaven no. Heavens no. <laughs> if they were trappers, do you think they would have left anything in the house? No. Did you go in the basement? I yet? haven't yet. Could be a mystery. I guess that will let us know if they were trappers or not, if there's a furnace down there. Yeah, the bailiff did say it was clear. Lots Clear as in there's... It's so clear there's nothing in there, yeah, or clear there's, there's... There's no people? We'll see about that. You didn't verify. You know what? I should have... I should have asked all the questions. Because if you left us with a dead body situation... Yeah, nothing living. Not my concern. Kind of fucked up my whole day. Yeah? Yeah, dude. This is the only thing I was doing today. Is it? And I was really hoping that it was going to be like a fucking action-packed, guns-drawn, mover scenario. Little to know that uh, we don't even need movers. Yeah. That's true. I don't know anything about this side of town. This is the first one we've done in Lorraine. I know. I text Tom, and then John was like, oh, uh... You don't need movers on site, we just leave everything locked in there. I was like, oh. Okay. And I text Tom again, I was like, oh, actually, no mind it, you don't need to be there. Just as a heads up. Yeah, just as a heads up, you will be doing the trash house. And You'll be here at some point. He's a good man, that Tom. Mr. Thomas, yeah. So then what, are you going back to the office after this then? Or are you going home? Uh, I'm going to go home because the stuff I need to do, I can do from home. Yeah. yeah, we're going to do stuff for senior and do some property change stuff for John. Easy, easy stuff. But it doesn't matter. Somehow I punched in and out on Friday, so... Worked 60 hours over the weekend. 
Wow, that's pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty good for not even uh, not even working Sunday. Yeah. All right, let's see what we got here. You think the screw holes will line up? Yeah, I think it's gonna be close, but I think they line up. I think I think they'll go through. Won't hit any metal, I hope. Practice. 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 Playoffs. Yeah, man, I'm just saying, they have to be. Cause look at all the the metal handles they have in here. Cylinders. This whole thing is aluminum. More aluminum over there. Aluminum. 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 <laughs> you got pool cues sitting out here. All the enchilada makes you could ever want in the entire world. Get out of here, fly, you little cocksucker. You weren't invited. Nobody invited you. Go home. Pay rent. Can't be here. You get really dark in here for a brief moment. Oh, hang on, I'm stuck on something. Nothing. Well, damn. Turns out it wasn't nothing. I'm stuck on this bad boy. Finished fallouts, that was pretty cool. Was it good? Yeah, that was pretty cool. I was gonna start watching it this morning when I got back from the gym, but then I was like, it hit me as I turned it on, like, wait a minute, I'm fucking just doing something. And then I texted you, and like, you two text later. Me. I got in there and there was nothing on the charger, and I was like, hmm, I usually you plan ahead a little bit. Yeah. A little bit. I, you know, I tried to. Evictions on Mondays are bad. That's a bad idea. I, I don't mind them because it's a nice way to start. But... But yeah, I looked at my calendar and I was like, I didn't schedule anything today. Like, All right, well, I'll watch Fallout, finish that. <laughs> I guess I'm just gonna hang out. Just gonna hang out there. And then you text me like, hey, do we need to charge stuff? Oh, yeah, that's right. And you're like, oh. God damn it, Vince, you ruined my week already. It's only Monday and it's 6 a.m. and you ruined my week. Oh, I can't watch Fallout. This is a good, uh. This is cool. There's like a resurgence in making video game things and not be like super garbage at it, which is cool. They, they've gotten better at that for sure. Because they did a pretty good job with Twisted Metal. I don't know if you watched that at all. I didn't. You told me that. Yeah. You and, and Derek maybe, or maybe just you. But, yeah, what is that, like a peacock or something? Mm -hmm. It's on the cock. No, I don't have that. I don't have no coal. No peak coal. I think there's only like eight episodes. Get a free trial and get power a quick free over a weekend. Quick freebie? Yeah. That's what I'm going to do to watch that kaiju. Once you verify that that's he, the correct show. You know what? Show. I think he was talking about Shogun. Did he tell you to watch Shogun? But I watch Shogun. That's that new one on FX that apparently is really good. I'll check that out. Yeah, I like samurai stuff. That's pretty fucking cool. 
a lot of Samurai stuff. Especially when they're like the Samurai and they throw them into like a modern world and they make any sense. Oh, this is not a modern world time. Fuck, dude. I want to see a samurai cut up a guy and shoot a Gatling gun at him. Won't be a Gatling gun, but maybe a musket, because it is, uh, like 1600s or something. Oh, okay. Yeah, definitely a musket. Does this have to do with when we went over there and we're like... Not we. At the time, it still would have been the British. So loosely, we, 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 loosely related we, we the, <laughs> the, the royal we, the royal we, the white people, we showed up and we were like, you're going to trade with us and you're going to give us a bunch of shit or we're going to kill all of you. And they were like, yeah, sure, why not? To our, to my understanding, I think the show's about, uh, it is about trade. But I, this, like, British guy tried to, like, go talk to them before the French or something, but he gets, like, stranded there, and he's, like, the only British guy. Like, I think his ship sinks or something ridiculous. Shit, it's totally uh, Britain versus France, and then uh, these guys just get, you know, suckered in by our shenanigans, as one does. That's how the United States won the world. We're like, hey, um, France, remember these pricks? Yeah, we got a problem with them now, too. Help come, us solve this. Come block these bastards. Give us a good blockade. You got ships. You got wealth. What do you want? What do you want to do here, bud? If you just don't let them get reinforcements, we'll attempt to kill every single person on land. Mm -hmm. And the British were like, fuck it, this war, this war sucks! <laughs> you got your assholes. I didn't want this place anyway. It fucking sucks here. It's too big and there's too much shit going on. And everyone's trying to kill us redcoats. Alright, don't get dark again. This time we have success. Oh no. This door frame is so tight. Am I hitting at the side or is it hitting at the top too? It looks like the one... I think it's hitting at the, just the top. It's like the one last is loose. I feel like this is in the way. Any loose screws by chance? No, it's just sitting. Well, let's see if it blocks. It does. Which means they can uh, fix this on turnover. Okay. Well, I just gotta get rid of that shim. Yep. But then again, that'll probably be too much. It'll talk too much about shim. No, it'll be like that shim is just thin slash thick enough. Hold the entire frame together. <laughs> yeah. It'll be very tr uh, problematic, I'm sure. Yeah. Mean like you? Yeah. Well, yeah, easily. Yeah. Like, and you ain't found a fire truck or something. Yeah, and that was like nothing. Yeah. You're like, I was upset that it was so light. What is this heavy? We should make a podcast. Tell stories and uh, play Secret Hitler. It'll start off being a podcast and then we'll just play games all the time. That's true. Somebody at the wedding I was at on Saturday told me that they listened to a podcast where these, this dude and his dad played Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> Worth it. Can't see inside.
Oh no! No. <laughs> He's like sign or something. He's a little thin. But it is breaking and entering, so. That's a crime. Yeah, that's a no go. That's the only crime I do, like, often. But it's like permission crime. I think not. You know what? We don't even need screws either. There's some on the porch. I'd like to see what you do with it. Those are for turnover. You melt those down, make yourself a one single bullet. <laughs> okay. Would you look at that? Good job, dude. Now we just gotta find uh, the water meter. Take some pictures. And... Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.